all right guys this message is for you if you are seeing this message it's because you're supposed to see it all right guys so let's see what is going on in your energy which you guys need to know these are general so only take what is for you simply leave what is not yours okay guys you know what is yours you know what is not make sure that you're also subscribed to your areas only placements love tarot as well anywhere areas is in you or your person's chart not just your four houses take advantage get all your tea get all your messages all right guys all right the energy is flowing it will fluctuate back and forth between you and your person okay guys so let's see what is going on don't you worry about a thing i'll be reading all the signs and the energy that i see here for you if you don't know already i am your shaman empress aka the shaman hummingbird baby okay i got you all right That's what you said. okay let's get this started all right let's see what's going on with you guys i hope everybody is doing well all right messages for the collective oh what is this the king of coins areas into source energy somebody here wants to um offer you something somebody here wants to reach out somebody here could be very stable and they could want to um offer you a hand. i heard offer you a hand in something okay they said you deserve it this person thinks you deserve something this could be the kind of provider, because that's what the King of Pentacles is. Um, you know, they only go and do stuff for people they feel like deserve it. They could have money and won't offer shit unless they feel like you deserve it. That's what she said. Yeah. We have the Eight of Pentacles. Yeah. Now, for some of you guys, this is somebody that works very, very hard. Okay? Or they know you work very, very hard. Um, Capricorn Energy. Somebody here wants to... Yep, they do. The Death Card. Oh, shit. This is somebody here that doesn't want a relationship, and this is not a relationship that is going to last. Somebody here wants to make you comfortable while they're in your life, but this is somebody here that's going to walk away. They already know they're going to walk away. This could be somebody here that already know they can't offer you a relationship. Now, hold up, child, because the king of coins is also a husband or a wifey, hubby or wifey. This person could be married. This could be somebody here that's like, look. I, 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 I'm not going to lie to you. I have a relationship. You know, I'm in a relationship or I'm married. But, you know, while we are dealing, I'm going to make sure you're okay. This person sees something in you. This could be somebody here that feels like maybe if they, you know, in another time, you know, you would be somebody they consider. But this is how they feel about you. This might be one of the reasons why they feel like they can't pass you up. But this will end. Yeah, this is exactly what I'm getting. Yep, because they want to take it. Somebody here can't resist you. I'm going to just be honest with you. And authentic. They said honest and authentic. They can't pass you up. Mm. Split the deck. Nine of swords. Yep, and a hangman. Now, this is somebody here that knows, you know, it's going to be in a hangman position. This is somebody that's... This, this is somebody here that wants to be exclusive as long as you're going to allow them to be exclusive, you might have to be the one to end things. But as long as you're willing to accept and have them, they're going to make sure you're okay or y'all are okay. Damn, y'all. What y'all doing? And this is somebody else here that they don't want you fucking with nobody else either. That's off the table. That's what she said. Mm -hmm. Arius, Jimin, and... Mm. Yeah, honey, they want to take that chance. We got the two of wands. That's that's what they have decided to do. It, the ball is in your court for somebody. Arius energy there again. Yep, the queen of wands because you're sexy as fuck. You're handsome-ish. <laughs> and they, they just, they, this is it. Somebody here wants to have an affair with you. Oh, my God. That's what she said. Oh, my gosh, y'all. What in the hell? Yup, the five of pentacles. But this is going to end. And this is somebody here that's going to end favor when they're gone. When it's over, it's over. When you call it off, you call it off. There ain't no, you know, I need help. Or do you still know? And this could be kind of selfish. And I totally understand that. But this is how this person feels. This is how they want to do this. Yep, the two of pentacles. Um, now... The thing is, I'm going to just tell you right now, if you cut this off, somebody here is going to let you cut it off. And when they do, or when you do, it, it, it's going to be a cut off of supply. Two of Pentacles and the Five of Pentacles. Um, 
if you decide, and I'm saying this, and this is the reason why I read the way I do, because as readers, oracle readers, uh, healers, Ricky healers, empath, empathics, whatever you want to call it, it's our job to read the energies, what is here to help you guys to see and choose what you want to deal with, because it is your life. That's between you and God. You know, I can't, I just have to read the energy. That's what I'm here to do. The thing is, this is what this person sees. This is what they want. But when this is um, cut off, this, uh, this will be cut off. I will feel like if you're going to connect with this person, um, I don't want to say that because you might feel like I'm being, I don't know. A little out of pocket but if you decide to do this i wouldn't just be you know if, if, if you like all right you know i feel it if you know I, you're going to give me what i want and i'm gonna give you know you're going to give me some of the things that i feel like i need and i'll give you some of the things that I, you know you feel like you want from me you know then you need to be wisely on with, with this because this is somebody that's offering you what you want it's up to you to get what you want out of this that's what they want though they want to make sure you're okay somebody here wants to manifest something for you and somebody here also knows obviously this can't last forever but when it ends they want to leave an impression on you they always want to yep they do they always want to leave a door open so you can fill them just in case there's a chance back in somebody here could be in a i don't know if i want to say a boring ass marriage Yep, the hangman. Mm. Oh, hold on, child. Let me take a look at this. Wait a minute, child. Hold up. Oh, child. The lovers. I can't make it up. Damn. And look at this. We. Said. I told you. The empress. This, 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 this could be somebody here, to be honest. The marriage is dead. They might be with, they're in a dead-ass marriage. Yep, the ten of cups. They might have kids together. That There's things that they have. Yep. Then then that's your confirmation. There's things that they have with this person that keeps them happy and content. This could be why they stay. It might not be why we would understand, you know, certain things, but they have like a, a certain understanding. This could be even like a sexless kind of marriage. Yep, it is. The higher fun and the nine of pentacles. And this is somebody here to be honest with you. You know, other people might even look at this person as being single. They ain't. Child, I need to. Oh, wait a minute, child. Because we got to see what the fuck is going on. Oh, Ten of Cups. Um, you give this person a sense of, I don't want to say like they live again, but, you know, you bring like happiness. This could be a happy time, maybe in their younger days. I feel like this is somebody, somebody here could be married to an older woman or an older man. Um, and, you know, they ain't child somebody here just said they sleep in separate rooms or they don't even sleep in the same room this person could sleep on the couch or something like that i'll make sure you see these cards child 838 oh my gosh um they could be they at one point in time they could have been very very happy with this empress the ten of cups okay um but you know they are stuck on memories that they have they had not they have with this empress whether this is a man or a woman strong areas and energy but there's there's nothing there this is also an empress that could know that this person cheats but they don't care because they could also know that this person's always coming home and we're gonna look at we're gonna look at this we're gonna look at you and we're gonna look at this person Okay, so they're showing me 838 again. So I'm going to look up that angel number. I'm also seeing, um, yeah, 838. I never looked at it like that. Yeah, why can't you do it like that? 838. And that was on your timer. Wow. Because the Empress is also uh, connects with the number three. In case you guys don't know that. Yeah. Oh, child. So, we need to look up 838, honey. 
Mm. Let's look this up. Uh, we're going to look at all the energy here and see what is going on. 1002. 12 is here. Your ancestors could be like letting you know certain things about this person. It's like somebody here could even be like very upfront with you about certain things and there's certain things you're not. Um, 838 is a sad that you're hitting in the right direction. Think of it as reassurance from your guardian angel that you're exactly where you need to be. For some of you guys, there, you um, stand out to this person. And you must be doing good. You're pulling a queen of ones, taking action. You could be building. You are doing something. You could also remind this person of, child, I really am trying not to say this, but I got to do my job. And I'm sorry if it comes off offensive, but... It's how they feel in our telemedicine. So I got to say this scorpion energy here as well. You remind this person of when they first got married to this person. This can also be a certain way that look you have because it's still, you know, the Empress is Aries energy. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm. Uh, for some of you guys, I'm hearing Usher. Child, no. You make me want to leave the one I'm with. Start a new relationship. Too. This is what you do. Child, somebody here feels like you make them want to end this relationship. In their in this marriage that they're in and be with you. The thing about the King of Coins is Aries and Tesaurus energy. So y'all match on a certain... Um, they say vibration. Mm. Okay. I want to look at, like, we're looking at you, honey. Oh, my God. I told you the lovers in the Six of Swords. This person sees you as a lover. They can't let past them. They want to experience it. Now, the Six of Swords is also ancestral. This is, and that's exactly what I was picking up on. So your ancestors could also be letting you know certain things about this person, child. Um, what do I want to see first, child? I don't know. There's something here, like this is, so I have to get it, I have to, I have to do my job. This might not last in the long run, but this is something successful that this person feels like y'all can have short term and while they're there they want to make sure that you're comfortable this could be somebody here that also feels like they know you work very hard and they could own things you know the queen king of uh, coins is uh, uh um is, it got money establishments resources um they could connect you they can even offer you a job someone here you have to be careful okay but they could be like you know what work for me you know i can i can help you yeah as well all right because when they leave out your life or when this in you're definitely obviously not going to be as stable as they were but then i'm gonna be honest you this person wants you to feel like that though yeah they do what's the death card mm -hmm. oh and this person is if this person is allowed to somebody here now let me break down the different situations of poly relationships Okay, because y'all know there's levels to the shit. That's what she said. This person may know this person cheat, but they don't talk about it. They don't bring shit home, and they don't let this person hear about it. Opposed to certain polyamorous relationships where three people are under the same household. You also hear of people having certain days of the week, or everybody's just knowing about everybody. Especially if same sexes are attracted, like if you if two women are into women. Hold up, child. Wait a minute. Oh, we gotta look at this empress. So this empress could be somebody that's also into women. Mm. Oh, what's the death card? Oh my gosh. Yeah. What's the death card? Mm. The four swords. Um, this is somebody here. The emperor. Yep. The reason why they have to end is because they're married to this empress. I can't make this shit up. Hold on one second, guys.
Okay, guys, my bad. They're playing back there. <laughs> so I have to tell them to be quiet, child. All right. Okay. This person is married. Yep. And um, this is somebody here, to be honest with you. Uh, they're not going to walk away from this person. Nope. Look, look at this. The Queen of Wands. But as long as you allow them and want them to be there, they will and they, will, they want to help you. Yep, this king of wands. This is, oh, child. Somebody, this person wants to be your boyfriend or your girlfriend. They just can never be your husband. I'm going to tell you something. You have to be careful with this person. Because next thing you know, y'all be together. You think you in a room of the fucking relationship if you take this person on. It been in five, eight, ten, twelve. You going around, my boyfriend. Y'all, This is somebody that will go around with you. Yep, that's what they're showing me. Yep, they'll come to your motherfucking old child. Somebody here, will, they'll come over to your family's house. The store. Yeah, they feel like you're a store. Y'all could be big together or y'all could really have, you know, a thing, like a real thing. You ever hear them stories where people's like, you know, he he's married. It's like, how the fuck he married? We've been together for like five years. You never really like know, but you do know. Right, because your ancestors, your spirit team, you get them nudges, you get them feelings, you know. I mean, this person could be up front with you to a sit. Like I said, there's a lot of things this person will say, and there's a lot of things they won't say. And I'm going to just say this. That's what she said. I love my uncle to death, but I'm going to just use him as an example. There was like, when he was in his days... These bitches really thought they was with him. He already, he always was married. He'd been married since he'd been the, out of the army. Okay, before he got his shit all the way together. You know, there he was at birthday parties, he getting pictures with him. It's like, what's going on? It's not that, you know, behind closed doors, we never tried to tell him. But at the end of the day, you know, family, at the end, you sometimes protect family when they wrong. It's when you get them by themselves, you tell them, you know damn well, I don't like you put me in that situation. You know, this person will play that card with you, so you know that. They'll take family pictures with you, too. Yeah. The store card. Now, um, as long as you will have them, if you was to sad to leave, this is somebody that's not going to stop you. When you don't want this no more, they're not going to stop you. Um, but they will definitely leave an imprint on you. Mm. So what's the nine of swords? What's the nine of swords? The lovers and show this person um, up twice. The lovers card here twice. There's, there's, but this person has feelings for you. This is somebody here that they they do. Y'all have a a a a, a, a I, I, I'm trying not to say it, but something very similar to what they're married to. It's the energy. It's fire energy. Y'all could be like fire signs or some shit, or have a lot of fire in your chart. What's the nine of swords? I mean, we need to check these nine of swords real quick, honey. What's the nine of swords? And this is someone here that will be honest with you. They are stuck in a marriage, but they will also think of ways. Yup, I can't make this up. The ten of wands to put burdens on you to make you stuck with them. You have to be careful with this person. What's the nine of swords? Mm. Yep, they're scared and nervous, but you are this person's wish fulfillment in the five of cups. The high priestess in reverse and the three of pentacles. Someone here is scared if they was just to lay it all the way out that you would just straight up end it. So they're going to like give you bits and pieces. Yep, page of cups in reverse. And they know you're going to feel some kind of way. Yep, the five of ones. And it could start a fight. Okay. Um, or something like that. And this could be someone, yep, seven of swords. And see, that's the problem. Also, they know if this person was to find out how much they really like dig for you, they would be in trouble. And like I was going to say, thank you, Holy Spirit. Love you so much. That's why they say until you get feelings for somebody, it's not really cheating. The Ace of Wands, yep. Mm. But they want to take this action and they're attracted to you. You turn them on. It's like they go back and forth in their head like they can't help it. Okay, let's see what's going on. Um, I'll, Let's take a look at this marriage. Then we're going to look at, at you. And I think I'm going to look at um, this person separately as well. What's the Empress? Show me the Empress. What's the Empress? Show me the Empress. What's the Empress for the collective here? What do I need to know about the Empress? 
I think we can know about the Empress. Mm. The Knight of Cups. The Ace of Swords. And the Ace of Cups. Um, this could be somebody here, to be honest with you. Uh, the truth, they've been through a lot. They've been through a lot with this person. And this could be someone here, um, they love them because of, um, you know, the things they've been through. They could be survive. This is also an empress that is quick on her feet and she knows how to get them out of situations or she knew how to get them out of a tough situation. Um, yep, the nine of pentacles and the ace of wands. Yeah. And this is somebody, so you know, that they went back to with the eight of cups in reverse. Yeah. Um, this, I'm going to tell you something. This empress could have proposed to your person. Five of ones in reverse. Yeah. And, yep, yep, they did. And that's why they got married. That's how they got married. Five of cups. Um, they know this will disappoint you. Um, they've been through a lot with this person. They're not, yeah, they have... They don't want you to know about certain situations in their relationship with this person. That's another thing. Um, here, let me see. I'm going to tell you something. This person's not leaving this person. It's not. It's not. No. They're not. They're not. They'll never tell you that straight up, though. Yeah. You see? But you open a certain door to them. Damn. I got to be honest. Because of what they've been through and because of how they are, they could. this could be... To be honest, a security blanket. They could be real safe with this person. I mean, they could, like, love this person. And it's like they have a certain love. And it's like, I'm all, you know, and I'm, I'm, they're, they're, I'm secure. I'm good. I know no matter what, I'm good here. But to be honest, this person isn't... You, 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 you get what I'm saying? It's like, that's what they have with them. But with you, it's more, it's like living a certain life. I don't know if that makes sense. They live in two different worlds, yep, with the two of swords. You are more like, you know, we're going to birthday parties, you're making things happen. I'm seeing you open up businesses. I'm supporting you. Um, we, we living it up. We're doing things. We could be traveling. We're happy. We're doing life together. We're both making sure each other is satisfied. To, the, to this is, you know, I'm coming home. My family's content. You know, making sure my wife is okay. Things is cool at the house. We good. I hope that made sense. I really do. What's going on here with this empress? A lot. Damn. Imprisonment in, in reverse. Somebody here um, was in jail. Oh, this person held this person down when they was in jail. They could have even got married in jail. Six of ones. Yep. And this is somebody here. They let all their mask off with this person. They confided in it. They have for forever. Now always have some kind of love here for this person. Yep. The seven of pentacles. And, um, you know, they built things. They built up, you know, something together here. Yeah, uh-uh. Look at this shit. The Eight of Pentacles keep coming the fuck out. Yup. It's like... I don't know how to put this. You are opening up certain doors in them, and this person has opened up certain doors in them. Yeah, expectation. We have court, child. And to be honest with you, I'm going to be honest with you. The, uh, yeah, this is something I don't know if this ain't going to last. I feel like this is somebody, I'm going to be honest with you, y'all. Somebody here could have always told herself, you know, I'm not, I'm going to stay with this person. You know, I'm not, I'm not going to, you know, I'm going to stay with them. You know, I'm not going to, it's like they're trying to talk themselves into it, but they, they, they have love. They're not in love with them. One of the things my grandfather told me, her, her and my grandmother was married for like 50 something years. You know, you keep falling back in love with each other. And if you don't, then you just have love. 
but you won't necessarily be in love. And some of you guys have seen that a lot. That's what has happened here. Yep, that's your confirmation. Hold on, guys. All right, dang, y'all. It was like I couldn't turn the phone off. Okay, okay, okay. Um, They're going to make it hard for you to, to turn this off. Okay. It's going to be a challenge. It's going to be difficult. Hmm. Okay. Damn, I mean, okay, okay. Let's just get it, let's get it in. Let's get this in. What else is going on here? Um, this person here is not going to make this easy. But you can end it anytime you want to. You're going to have to stand on it, though. Yeah. All right, let me look at you. What's the Queen of Wands? Oh, the Seven of Wands and the Two of Cups. Yep. And this is somebody here. I told you they're going to try to like block you out of relationships and make it hard for you to leave them. Um, yeah. And for some of you guys, if you are like young, um, you might like. It's like. You know, they, they want your best. Your best years could be involved in this. So, I, I don't know. Yup, the two of pentacles. Yeah, honey. They're going to make you juggle back and forth, Jow. Yup, the four of swords. Yeah. And for something here, it's like, you know... It, 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 and this could be somebody here that's like a controller. That will control things. Like, soon as... Like, things get weird or you start falling back, they're going to cut off support. They will for some of you guys. Yeah. Five of Pentacles. I can't make this shit up. Damn. Yeah. What's this, what King of that? Coins? Show me King of Coins. Damn. Okay, hold on, y'all. Yep, the Ten of Pentacles and the King of Pentacles. Look at that. Clarifying the King of, King of Pentacles. This person wants to pay your bills. And you need to be careful of this person, like... Putting you in a house or putting you somewhere or like, no, nah, you can be at the, yeah, no, nah, we moving you. Matter of fact, you can't afford that house if you like that house, baby, because, you know, what you got and what I got, we got it. It'll be wish fulfillment for the both of us. Mm-mm. Yup, the eight of wands. Yeah. Okay. But for some of you guys, see, that's a, that's an offer here. And this could be also somebody here. It's like, but they will have to have access to eight of wands to come and go as they please and shit like that. And this could be somebody here. It's like, all right, if they move on, you need to be able to make sure that you can afford stability. Seven of swords. Yep. Cause they would, they, you know, that's something they had, um, that they would do. Yeah, they they won't tell you. you. You know, you cut me off, we done. I cut you off, we done. Honey, that payment is on you, okay? I'm just saying. Mm. Let's see something. I'm going to look at you, too. Whether you're a man or a woman, it don't matter. Can I see more of this here with this king of coins? What do we need to know? Mm -hmm. Tell me something else with this king of coins. This person's going to make it hard for you to turn this off, okay? It is not going to be easy, all right? to walk away from them. Distance and horizon and the eight of wands. Somebody here wants to move you out of, um, or, or they want you, um, they could live out of distance, but they like that. They could even try to talk you into moving some kind of distance or something. Child, we got marriage. Oh, shit. Now, somebody here could also be like trying to move you in a different city. Maybe even state where you guys can get married. This motherfucker is... Stuck. That's what she said. Somebody here, you could be married in, 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 I don't know, let's just say Colorado. Okay? But they married to this person in Mississippi. Yup. And that could be their plans. Oh my gosh. In the damn Queen of Pentacles. That's what she said. Damn. And that's the truth. Why? Because you guard Venus. You see Venus? 
Let me show you Venus around this lady's neck. Is it this card that got Venus on it? I could have, is it this one? I may have the wrong card. I could have, I, I swear it was this card. Okay, y'all, so I could have made a mistake there. I swear, I swear it was this card or I'm just not seeing it. Now I'm going to look for my other lady because I know there's a lady in here with Venus on her neck. Well, I can't do that right now because that's going to take up too much time, but I really, really want to. Y'all know I'm like straight up authentic about, yep, yeah, this is Venus. <laughs> Sorry. Venus is around her neck. Okay. Um, for some of you guys, uh, that's the truth. Okay. Mm. This person could talk you into certain things and then, you know, you listen to them, you participate. You Y'all could be in a certain home, a certain area that they kind of want to give you and put you in or some shit like that. And then they y'all get married and that will block you from another connection this is this is somebody here wants two people they want to be with they want two wives and they and they feel like they want they want this this is what they want and this is how they feel like this shit is going to work master number 33 and master number 44 is here we got 33 and 44 here this is how this person feels What's the Queen of Wands? I mean, the, um, yes, yeah, sorry. What's the Queen of Wands? Child, I can't even get this. This is crazy. This is what they want, though. Somebody here is, they, they feel like they this could work. Because they got this right here under a certain control. It, there's already a certain flow of energy that's just cool here. It's getting you down, and then it will work. That's how they feel. And that's exactly what I'm seeing. Mm. What's the queen of wands? If you was the one to get married, they want to be the one you that the, you, you would choose them. I gotta be the one you need. I gotta be the one you love. I gotta be the one. Is that Jacket Edge I'm hearing? Cause I would always love you so. Some shit like that. I'm off beat a little bit. What's the queen of wands? Mm -mm. This person, oh child, tell you, you gotta be careful. Yup. The seven of cups, the three of pentacles, the four. This person here already know that somebody here feels like you're. You, they they know other people want you. I mean, cause look at how the way they want you or something like that. Or you're not gonna be. You know, somebody here that's going to be single for long or some shit like that. And that's what they don't want to see. Um, this is selfish of this person. They know this. But they can't help it. Nope, the king of wands. Yep. Mm, the king and the queen of wands, baby. That's what they want. Somebody here feels like it's unfair. They know this. Mmm. Hold on, child. Let me pull some energy on you real quick. All right. What's the queen of wands? Real quick. Mm. Cause I will always love you so. We'll fill out. We got the gift in reverse, immature man in reverse. And for some of you guys, this person here, you ever walk away or y'all break up, you're going to see a different side to them. Yep, and they taking all their shit back. Or like I said, or what they used to do. The gifts you used to give. Yeah, when they get in their feelings. And this is also somebody here, when they get in their feelings, they pull back or some shit. Yep, poverty. Damn. That's what she said. And, and that's what it, it looks like to be here. It's like, it's, somebody here is like, if you leave me, you going back where the fuck you came from. This is somebody here that could also get very cold. Because the king of wands is also very cocky. You walk away, I'm taking my name off the lease, the motherfucking light bill, the gas bill. You know, it, 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 they could be very cocky, a little arrogant. They could care less. Because somebody feels like they'll be damned to see you move on and build in some shit they gave you. They could still feel like that. At the end of the day, Maybe you will still also benefit from certain things. 
but they're not going to help you benefit in another relationship. And to them, that's enough to be this cocky way towards you if this happens or some shit like that. Mm. Um, child, I don't even know what to say. I just don't know what to say. Uh, let's see. Hold on, because my cards fell over a little bit. All right. Let's see. Let me see. Is there anything else? That could... No, that's all of them. All right. Let's see. Mm. What's the written message? Let me move these over here. Let's get a written message from this person. Yeah. Uh, because I'm going to tell you, somebody here has their upper advantage. You know, this other marriage give this person an advantage. This is another reason why they won't leave this person. It's like, they could easily say, you know, I'm traveling. This because this person got resources, businesses. I got to go here. You know, I'll be a couple weeks before I get back. I'm going to check on the house, make sure you're good. I might have to run back out. And that's giving them traffic like running back and forth to you if you was to go along with this plan this this, this could even be at like a distance where it's distant enough or out of town or some shit like that what is this love damn this person here they they love you that's what she said somebody here they're they they have love for their wife but you have you know i know i don't know how to break this down because some people will argue and say well you can't be in love with two people. Yeah, that is true, but there's people that get left in marriages when they find other people and they still be in the marriage for a while. How do you explain that? Um, you know what I'm saying? So you have to under understand what I'm saying because they still have love with somebody, but they fell in love with somebody else. This person has fell in love with you. They have love with somebody else. They manifested love with somebody else, but the love is, is gone, dead. You ever hear somebody say, you know, our marriage been dead. It's been going. I just moved on. Unplug. Turn it all off. It turns them on. And somebody here, when it's just you and them, they 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 could even turn their fucking phone off. Damn. That's what she said. Boom. Okay, I'm sorry. It isn't personal. Shit's not always about you. Now, for some of you guys, it's like this. Like I told you. When they, if y'all was to end this, and it, when it does end, it's like they shutting this shit down. It's not, it's because it's not just about you. There's other people here. Mm. Y'all, what y'all gonna do, child? Because I just, I want to know what is you gonna do, honey? Because, ooh. Okay, ooh, we got trust. Trust came right on out, dreams and spiritual. This person is all, um, also pops up in your dreams. And I kind of saw that with the four swords. Y'all do, y'all have a, a, a bond. This person gives a certain energy that they needed and manifested from in their life, even when they were at low points. Here. But y'all could be more on a, on a spiritual bond. This is this is not like a soul. I, I don't I don't I don't think they're with a soulmate. They're with somebody they have an understanding of life and they just share that shit together. But this connection is the connection they could have, like, always dreamed of, like, having. They, there's somebody here settled for somebody. The marriage they in is the marriage they settle in. But the marriage they want is with you. You're the kind of marriage they would want. The kind of marriage they want. That's why they don't want you to turn us off. All right. Some of you guys could have just dusted or something. Some, some, someone here just got their root. Child, we got love and love. I'm serious. This is two different love frequencies. This is I have love. And this is I'm in love. That's how that shit works. 
people be married, like I said, and be in a whole other connections. Damn. Hold on, y'all. Guilty. We have rekindled. Somebody here is guilty because they wrong. They know they really can't be in this energy with you. And this is somebody here that will always try to keep things rekindling or they will always try to rekindle with you. Um, because the thing is, you're going to get enlightenment about the illusion. You're going to get enlightenment about this. Like I said, for some of you guys, it's going to be your spiritual... Yup. Oh my gosh. It could be your spiritual soul members. But didn't I tell you spiritual and soul? Y'all have a spiritual bond. They settled for this other person. They're not spiritually um, connected to this person. Like they are to you. This is another reason what like... You know, they're in love. Somebody here knows they are married to the wrong person. But they're staying with this person. They settled. And, the, and they're not going to walk away because of the things they have, share, and the trust. They also do trust this person. Yep, connection and power. And they have power over this other connection. You know, I mean, child, I mean, yeah. Let's get some letters. Mm. What's the letters here? What's the letters here? Whether this is a man or a woman, honey, you know we are living in a goddamn millennium. Okay, we are in the millennium. It doesn't matter. All good. Don't you doubt shit. Because usually what you are doubting is it, 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 something that you should be counting in. It probably is like that. Just saying. All right, let's see. I just saw out of town. Oh, my gosh. This person here wants to move you out of town. Yep. Or keep you. It's like they'll be willing to do that. Like, let's, let's just. This could be their, like, their little plan for real. Mm. If I can, can I get a couple? Y'all got card. Nope. Damn. Okay, I'm going to try one more time. <laughs> if I can, can I get a couple? Because that was even more than before. If I can, Holy Spirit, please. May I just get a couple cards here? If I can, if not, then... Oh my gosh, no. Okay, y'all. Y'all see it. All right. Quality time is somebody's love language. And someone here wants you at a distance on purpose because it takes time to get back. But that's the time they could also be having with you or something like that. Here... Yeah, we have missed. Some of you guys are spiritual. This is a spiritual bond. You guys talk spiritual talk. Y'all could be having spiritual conversations. We have M. We have heart chakra. Yeah, some of, somebody here is a son or daughter of Avatar of Oshun. We have X. We have Mai. Someone's name could be Maya. Hmm. Someone here thinks you are like theirs. Mm -hmm. Dharma, you got good karma coming in. Physical touch is also somebody's leg, love language. And we have T. Someone's name could be Max. Or they could be that could be short for something. Matt. Someone's name could be Matt. Someone here is a son of door. Oh my gosh. Someone here is connected to Optila. Yup. Mm. Some of you guys also, um, you could be getting a lot of down. I told you your spiritual team. Yup. You could be getting a lot of uh, downloads. Papa Optila is connecting with you. The Dominions, the Seven Choir, fighting off evil. And we have, yep, Archangel Michael. I feel like you are protected from a certain... Uh, this is this is what I'm getting. For some of you guys, it's like you are protected from it getting to a certain level. It's like you will get warning signs where it's like you need to let this go. You need to end this. And that's exactly when you should do it. Um, yep, we got Archangel Hanel. Archangel Hanel guards like clairvoyance, like the future, sightseeing. Yeah, I knew it. We got Jay. Someone here could be a Nephilim. 
All right, very big and tall. Yeah, honey. I, uh uh. There's a sad to this person that you might not know as well. Someone's name could be um, TJ. Somebody here is a JT fan. I just saw JT. Some of you guys could have just got taxed in something or some shit like that. Someone's name could be A up AJ. Mm. Let's see what else fell down here. Damn, y'all almost couldn't pick these motherfucking cards up. Yeah, I knew it. The six choir fighting temptation. And we also have Shango. Oh, child. Yeah, hold on. Somebody here, it's like you could be trying to fight temptation off here. But you guys, this person, Shango and Oshun is here. Hold on. Oh, my gosh. Husband and wife. I told you. Y'all have a certain, like, energy. Y'all spirits recognize each other. I'm like, this is crazy, y'all. I don't even know how to... I don't know what to say. I have to just test, give this energy. Like, you know, read it. But what the fuck? I don't even know how to tell you how to... I don't know. This... <laughs> What are, I don't, I, child, it's like, what are you going to do? Because I don't even know what to tell you. I really don't. I, I This is your spirit husband. That's what y'all are recognizing in each other. That's why this is, it's complicated but simple. Damn. I don't even know what to say. I'm just going to get the damn oracle, child. Y'all got me just throwing the cards down because I don't even know what to say. Mmm. Mmm. I also feel like spirit is trying to get some, like, counterparts. And sometimes why this happened is because, you know, once we get here, we have certain agreements, y'all. You know, some of us are even married before we fucking come here. And what gets in the way and what we get into when we get down here on Gaia, well. Yep, repairing a bad body. I told you, the body, mind, and spirit. Some of you guys got Optila in your Orbi. He's, he's trying to... Um, Give you downloads. Yep, meditation is stillness. Some of you guys need to meditate. You have to meditate so you can get clarity. It's like you'll get clarity of 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 like you. Some of you guys might even like pray and ask. Like, please give me clarity. Oh, and you gonna get it. Oh, you gonna get it. This is crazy. Wow. I also feel like somebody here don't know what the fuck to do. I gotta say that this person could really know they're like supposed to be with you. Because they might even got downloads on this shit. Both of y'all could be. Mm -hmm. And this is their fucking plan. That's what she said. Crown games, right use of power. Yeah. So they're going to play. This is also like playing with your head in a way. Not letting you be clear on what's really going on. Mm -hmm. 
Somebody is with a person by choice. They know this is not their person. They know you're their fucking person. But they are here. That's that's the best way I can put this shit right now. Without it being... Because I, I don't want the video being longer than it is, honey. It's going to take six motherfucking days for this shit to upload. Okay? But that's that's it. I don't know what to say. I don't even know what to tell. Y'all, this is tough. This is a really sticky-ass situation. I, I feel like child. I don't even go in there. What, what's the oracle message? Is I just gotta do, do, child. I ain't even go in there. What's the oracles? This is wild. Damn! I'm sorry. Ooh! I'm trying to tell you contract. You in a contract with this person, but they have signed in a contract with this person. I told you. You, some of you guys were, you're, 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 you were supposed to, they're supposed to be with you. But they ended up in this situation and they're just there. Choices and their consequences, consequences. Damn. We also have initiation. Movement towards adventure is also here. Diving into tasks and possibilities for a union. I'm going to tell you something. This is why this is going to be dangerous for this person. If you get the strength to, let's say, just end it with this person and just be like, look, I'm just, I got to be done. I don't think they're going to be able to take it. I don't. Because they're going to get a chance to experience you. Their true fucking counterpart that they're really supposed to be with, even though they're in a situation. But this is by choice here. And I'm not saying they don't have their own right choices. Because that's between them and God of why, what this was. And they could always have some kind of respect level where they're like, you know, maybe they even made a promise over here. Like, look, man, we always go run, you know, after what did somebody here. This person feels like somebody showed them like true, authentic love here. And that's the kind of love they built on that. But y'all are spiritually bonded. Y'all are counterparts here. They're like. Stuck between a rock and a hard place. Yep. The disowned self. And for some of you guys. You know. You may start to feel. You know. Eventually like. Look. We just going. Let's just stop this. Let's just stop the fucking madness. Let's just end it. You know. I, I just. I, I can't. This could be even after things are more, like, revealed to you. But I don't feel like... I feel like that's when this marriage over here is going to end. That this person that they're, like, have settled for. Yeah. Mm. Yep. Clarity and organizing... Organization of housing. Some of you guys, this is somebody here. Oh, yeah. I told you after a period, I'm telling you, when it's in and it gets cold, this is somebody here that's going to start cleaning house. And this is spiritual house cleaning. Like really thinking about what matters to them. Damn. Yeah, honey. And they are going to think very hard. Oh, I told you. The Garden of Venus. Oh my gosh. And some of you guys could have been in like in the garden together. Yeah. Preparations come to fruition. And here you guys meeting again. Repair the veil for forgiveness. Oh my gosh, y'all. I cannot make this shit up. I, I, I'm, 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 I don't, wow. I hope I explained this correctly. I really do. I don't even know if I'm going to upload this motherfucking message. It's like I, I want to upload it and I don't want to upload it. We got Virgo and Aries. For some of you guys, this person, when they leave you, they're going to get sick. They're going to get sick. Yup. Yep, they are. And you can, you, for some of you guys, you know, the first house is a, a, also about appearance. Um, you might even see this person get sick. Like, they might really get, like, sick. And it might affect them, their looks. And, you know, when you get depressed sick, 
you don't like groom yourself correctly. Not that you're stinking, but like you ain't keeping your hair up. Your beard ain't up. You're, you know, you're not, you're, you're letting yourself go. And that could be Vernet like, nah, man, I got to really get, get, get my, my shit in order. Because at the end of the day, I want to come home and be happy. Child. What's the sign of planets? I don't even know what to say. What's the sign of the planets here? Oh. Child, this, it felt like something then broke, child. They tried to break my tree, child. Shit. Um, strength. Passion. This, 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 if the passion is too strong. I won't be surprised if we see Mars. We, yeah, look at this. Tension. And there's talk. Um, there, there's talk. There, there could be talk in the community about this marriage here. Maybe people already noticed, like, you know, you know how people, like, even your neighbors could be married, and to them, you know, they feel like everybody knows we're together, When we look at, other people could look at them like, you know, we see y'all together, but there's something off about them, like, I just can't figure it out. There could be other people that already know or see, like, there's something off about them. Change, this person is changing. This is when Metro Retrograde come in. Whenever y'all split, when Metro Retrograde hit that ass, that's when they gonna pop back up. Yeah, and this is somebody, oh, yep, somebody here has been activated who you were since the solar flare. When a divine feminine and divine masculine came um, on this planet and even energy, yep, partnership, rebirth, they went through a transformation. I don't know if the person they are with know they went through this specific ass transformation, but they went through a transformation. Mm-hmm. I don't even know what to say, y'all. I'm really like journey. Yep. And they've been on this journey ever since. Are they going to get in this journeys with you? And we have Pisces. Yeah. I just want to see something. Yeah. Yep. It could be hot and cold. I knew it. Yep. Middle of the deck, child. This is crazy how this energy is coming out. I just want to scream. Yeah. Mars energy. When I split that fucking deck open. Damn. That's crazy to me. I don't, I'm, I'm just... We have Scorpion. <laughs> we have Leo. We have Aqua Arius. We have um, Libra. You can have that in your Pluto. Your seventh house. I don't not know what to say. I'm going to struggle if I want to upload this message because I don't even know if I want to get into describing how I feel about it because it, it I don't want to make it any longer, this video. But it does give me, like, it makes me hesitate. So we're going to see if you see this message, this video. Um, I struggled with myself and I decided to post it for whatever reasons. I'm going to have to give it to Spirit. I'm going to have to give it to God and let um, him tell me what he wants me to do with it. Um, with this. Because this is sensitive. This is sensitive information. Okay, guys, I love you all. Don't forget to hit that like button. Hit that bell. Hit all that will keep you tapped in and tuned in. And you will also be notified when your messages and ready are available for you. Oh, my gosh. This was an hour long, y'all. Yeah. All right. Stay dope. I'll catch you in your next video. Upload. I'll share your name. Huh?